I had an idea for something special tonight. A Friday date night supper. I'm doing a riff on a iceberg lettuce wedge salad with blue cheese dressing. I've got some steak patties, seasoned just right, broiled to medium, and there you have it, quick and easy. The ground beef, it's 80-20 mix, is mixed with some breadcrumbs, salt and pepper, and a liberal amount of Worcestershire sauce. Then I broil them, not too long on either side, maybe five minutes. And then up next is the dressing. I've taken sour cream, mayonnaise, buttermilk, add vinegar and then stir. Finally, I add the blue cheese, about a half a cup, stir that well. And then I end up with some creamy blue cheese dressing with lots of blue cheese in it. My onion slabs, I size those thick. They're at least three eighths of an inch thick. I put those in a frying pan, have some butter on them. Be sure to salt and pepper them also ahead of time. After they've browned, then I put a mix of Parmesan cheese and Dijon mustard and some tarragon. Put a dollop, a generous dollop, on top of the onions. Cover the onions and let it steam a little bit and melt down the topping. I've cored my lettuce, cut it in half, and I'm not using it as a wedge, and I'm just cutting my salad like it's going to be a toss salad. I've got fresh apples in it, and then I've added some cranberries and pecans, and then all I have to do is just put the dressing on. That looks like really good. It's got so much blue cheese in it, and that mixture of buttermilk and sour cream and mayonnaise, that makes it pretty creamy. Then the bacon on top, that's, that's the icing on the salad, so to speak. Wow, doesn't that look good? Well, let's plate everything, and then we'll sit down and taste it. Well, let's try everything here. We have do the meat first. Get a little bit of onion to go with it. Some of the tarragon parmesan cheese. Tarragon on the cheese mixture is just right. I like the thick cut onion too. I think that's a nice touch. There we go. Very good. And let's try the salad. That looks good with the bacon on it and some fresh apple and don't forget we've got the cranberries and pecans in there too.